LMCU has been a huge partner in helping us promote and lift up individuals in our communities who are doing good things. It's what we like to call paying it forward. The credit union's involvement in bettering the lives of West Michiganders doesn't stop there. Uh, here to share more is Vice President of Community Relations, Matt Cook. Good morning, Matt. How are you? Good morning. I'm doing great. Thanks for being here. Of course. Appreciate the time. Tell about this Pay It Forward program. In February, we had the gala, right? You guys gave away that big check to our person of the year. Talk about that involvement in the Pay It Forward program. Yeah, we've really appreciated our partnership with Fox 17 and, and all that Janice and this team does to promote the Pay It Forward program and really recognize those individuals in our community that go above and beyond, but that aren't always recognized for that work. And this is a great program program to be able to do that and so we have loved being involved and being able to celebrate with those winners it was a little disappointing during the pandemic not to be able to do that and but you guys still found really creative ways to recognize and lift up those stories and so we have really appreciated the partnership and being able to recognize those individuals it's good that we're like-minded in that because obviously news is always covered with negative stuff there's a lot of bad in the world to highlight that good is important to us and of course important to you as well lmcu of course and it, you know it really fits our model as a not-for-profit institution institution as a credit union, you know, the people are who make us up as an institution. And so that's really important and fits really well with us as a brand. And of course, there's this new playground that you and the YMCA got together. Talk about that too. Yeah. So we were really excited. Uh, last month, we came together with the YMCA. The 415 Franklin slash Martin Luther King Jr. Uh, site is a collaborative effort. Madison Square Church owns the building, but shares it. Um, ICCF is located there, both with their corporate office and also residents on the top floor for affordable housing. Uh, and then the Jacqueline Baber Bay Early Childhood Center is located on the main floor. Uh, and the YMCA and the Elon C have some early childhood classrooms, but there was no playground space in this. It was the old Grand Rapids Christian High School. And yeah. so uh, we were able to come together with the YMCA uh, in early May and about 30 volunteers, along with our partner Sinclair Recreation, a local company based out of Holland. And we made the playground. You're seeing the images yeah, I mean, right the, now. The smiles are amazing. Uh, right? It was so much fun. It. it was actually last Tuesday we got to dedicate the space. And so there are kids that are out there. And instead of having to walk a couple blocks. Um, I'm a parent of young children mm -hmm. and I know how much it, effort it takes to move kids. Uh, so to have that right outside their doors, right on site, uh, both for the residents and then also for the Early Childhood Center is amazing. So we're really appreciative of all the people that came together to make that happen. Absolutely. I'm going to keep tooting your horn too because the, uh, the Roots and Education program, right, the, this grant, uh, and you just announced the winners, didn't you? We did. So we had 25, this was our third year of this program. So we had the opportunity for anyone in our community, both throughout Michigan, Michigan in our service area and also in Southwest Florida to nominate a, an educator in their lives um, that's made a difference. And so we had students do it, we had parents do it, we had educators uh, that nominated their peers and also administrators. And so over the last couple of weeks, we've been able to go around to different classrooms and be able to deliver uh, those grant dollars to those teachers directly. Some of them are using them to further their education. Some are using it to help with things in their classroom. Some are, um, you know, in the spirit of pay it forward or actually using it for things that their school needs, not necessarily directly to wow. their own classroom. So it's really excited. We really have loved the impact that those educators have. And we were founded by a GRPS teacher in 1933. So oh. it really fits that. Well, that fits really well. That, that's a little bit of information I didn't know. So LMC was founded by a teacher. In 1933, a GRPS teacher kind of coming out of the um, Great Depression came together with a few other teachers and founded what was then Grand Rapids Teachers Credit Union and is now Lake Michigan Credit Union. Love that. Didn't know. I keep, keep that education component because God knows those teachers need every bit of help we can get them. And then this doesn't stop. I mean, you guys are so involved in this community. I mean, the, the youth, uh, what was it the uh, Ted, what am I thinking, the Ted Raspberry Youth Baseball? Yep. Foundation. Yeah, so this Saturday, uh, the YMCA, uh, again, and the Whitecaps uh, and Meyer are all coming together with LMCU uh, to be able to celebrate the start of the Ted Raspberry Youth League, yeah. which is a free league for kids to be able to play baseball in inner city Grand Rapids. And so there will be a big celebration this Saturday at Riverside Park um, to kick that off. And then they'll play throughout the uh, summer. And they definitely are still looking for volunteers if you want to help coach. But <laughs> we're excited to come beside that and, you know, certainly um, are really excited for those kids to get that chance You're looking to play. for coaches, you say? Uh, indeed. <laughs> I coach my, my, my daughter's t-ball league. I don't know if I qualify to, to get a little bit. The there you go. That, <laughs> any help they can use. <laughs> now, of course, Lunchtime Live in Kalamazoo, the Coast Guard on the, I mean, you guys are everywhere. We we want to do everything we can to be a part of the communities that we serve and we don't like to just have our logo out there but we really do mm. want to invest back in the communities and, and we're owned by our members and so we want to give back to the communities that our members and our employees live and work in and so 
we try to do that every day and have exciting things, you know, happening literally every day across the, the markets that we serve. But um, you really want to be an integral member of the communities that we're serving. As you are, Matt. Thanks for the time this morning. Yeah, thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Keep doing the good work you do. And we appreciate the partnership you have, especially with our Pay It Forward program. Lake Michigan Credit Union, good place to put your money. LMCU.org. Check them out there or all over social media as well. Or you can call them at 616-242-9790. Thanks again, Matt. Thank you. You bet.